Good morning, my name is Stephen and welcome to Morningcraft. Today, we're going to build Hagrid's house, which was suggested by a commenter. So, grab a drink, get comfortable, and let's begin. So, in one of my more recent shorts, I asked what I should build next, and one of the comments was to build Hagrid's hut from Harry Potter, and I, I've i watched the Harry Potter movies, I'm not obsessed with them, but they're pretty good, and they're still pretty good, even after so many years. And given that Murphy destroyed our original pumpkin patch, Hagrid's house would make a good replacement as he has a bunch of pumpkins too. So I grabbed all the pumpkins I could, and then I had a look at this reference image, and I decided to get to work. I found that this piece of sloping terrain matches the sort of landscape where his house is built. And so I decided that this would be the perfect place to start my build. I built a very basic path leading up to the house, and then I laid down some foundations using mud blocks and spruce wood. Mud blocks are definitely the closest I can get to a sort of weathered stone effect, so that's what I chose to use here. If you've made it this far into the video, I want to know if you've seen the Harry Potter movies. Comment down below. In the reference image, you can see that there are two sections of the building, a staircase up to the smaller one, and then a smoking chimney in the background. And you can sort of see that coming into place now on my build. Old man, you have stood in my way for too long. I am relieving the kingdom of your feeble hand. You will bend your knee to my sword. It is so painfully obvious to me now. You are not just a fool, but a tyrant too. You may climb fast, but your fall will be just as swift. I accept my fate gracefully. This traitor has no right to walk these streets. For too long, the great waters of Canalis have been a tributary to the meager Mornington. I declare this and our neighbors as the kingdom of Canalis. The dawn belongs to us. Soldiers, line the streets and bring me the king. Remember to stick around to the end of the video for our daily quote. So with the main structure of the build taking shape, I decided to start work on the stone roof. And I used cobblestone stairs for these. And then I put the chimney in place and I put a campfire in it to keep it smoking away. I then finished off the roofs with a central spire. I popped an andesite wall on top to give it that nice sharp spike. And overall, I'm pretty happy with the rustic style of this build. I added in a few fence posts to match the wooden supports. And then it was pretty much done. I improved the path a little bit Like, subscribe, and share to give your friends a great start to their day. And with the main section of the build in place, I got to work on our new pumpkin patch. Put down some water sources. And then I used a hoe to till the land into farmland.
Once the farmland was wet, I then planted down a bunch of pumpkin seeds and came back with some bone meal to turn these into proper pumpkin plants. Here we go, it's taking a bit more shape and you can see those slowly growing. If you see the dog-headed king, tell me at once. Failure to do so will be punished in the arena. If anyone comes around asking, you don't know where I am, and let's keep it that way. But with the pumpkin patch in place, Hagrid's house was nearly done, and I think I did a pretty good job of recreating the reference images in my world. Obviously, I'm going to need a huge forest behind it, maybe with a giant spider, or uh, what else is in the forest? Maybe a, a nice little preparation ground for some games where maybe they're keeping a dragon. But yeah, I think I did a pretty good job, and I hope that you're pretty happy with my uh, attempt at this. Let me know in the comments down below. Don't tell Murphy where I am you so much for watching i hope you've had a good morning and if it's not morning where you are you can save that for tomorrow and i hope you make today the very best it can be in the next episode we're going to build a beautiful italian style farmhouse so i hope to see you again next time on morning craft i post a new video every morning at 8 a.m and now it's time for the daily quote.